guys, this is Jessica and welcome back to my channel. So today I have another swatch video for you today and it is on the ColourPop Pressed Eyeshadows. Now ColourPop is a awesome brand. They can do no wrong in my book. I love their liquid matte lipsticks. I love their lip glosses. I love their satin lipsticks. I just, I love their highlighters, everything. They do have these, which are their Super Shock eyeshadows, which I'm not really a fan of because, like, it's more of a um, wet consistency. I just don't like it. It's some brushes work and some brushes don't. And then, like, some pigmentation is really good and others isn't. So I'm not really a fan of these. The pressed eyeshadows are a amazing they are so good and they have such a big color range I believe they have about 31 colors or around 31 colors and they have three different palettes that hold four colors in them and those are $18 each but if you want to get just the individual pans they're only $5 each that's like so awesome and for the quality that these are so freaking good i used it on my eye today and i just these colors are so pigmented and they are so buttery and creamy they are amazing it sounds like i'm talking about food but i always sound like i'm talking about food <laughs> um there is a little bit of fallout with these but it's only because they are so buttery and creamy and a really really good formula i got 16 shades you are going to get these individual ones you will need a z palette or some sort of uh, magnetic thing to put them in because they are magnetic so before you leave my channel don't forget to click that subscribe button it's free it doesn't cost you anything but only if you want to we don't do peer pressure here and I just want to thank you for all of my new viewers and all my new subscribers and I hope you all like this video so let's get to the swatches for the single ones this is how they are going to come they're going to come in this little color pop packages like most of these single pans do and um you just open them and it has a protective sleeve over it and you can just um pop it open and then take out the eyeshadow pan and just put it in your z palette they do have the name on the back along with color pop so if you have you know different ones like i have makeup geek and carity um you will know which ones go with which but i like to have a z palette for all my color pop a z palette for my makeup geek and a z palette for you know each individual ones so this first shade right here is called Firefly and this is a matte color and is a pale beige color. Um, it's so, these are just like so creamy, like come on. You almost can't see it because it basically is like my skin tones. Let's see it right there. And these aren't really, they're not too chalky, and there's not really um, a lot of fallout. This color is Wake Up Call, and this is a matte color, and it's a warm sand color. This color is Bel Air, and it is a matte cool taupe color. This color is made to last and it's a matte color and it is a neutral mauve color. Here is Lime Crimes Divine Color which obviously is my favorite color in that palette and this is made to last. This color is IOU and it's a matte color and it is a mid-tone orange color. Creamsicle kind of color, I guess. That is a beautiful color. That would be awesome if you're doing like a paradise or like a firebird color. That would be bomb. This color I love. I used it on my lids today. It's 
everything. I feel like it's going to be one of my favorite go-to shades. I'm going to need a stock up on this color. This is Note to Self and it is a matte warm caramel color. Such a good color. So good. Oh, so good. Come on, look at that. Even if you put that in the crease and like smoke it out, take the lead and it is a matte color and it is a dusty gray. Sometimes you don't want like that dark black color. So this would be pretty good. This would be good if you're like afraid of doing like black in your inner corner or whatever or for your bottom lash line. Wait for it. No, really. This color is called Wait For It. It is a matte hot peach color. And you know, peach colors are so in right now because Too Faced Peach Palette, Kylie Jenner's peach palette thing going on. So, but you know what? This is only $5 compared to like $60. This color is called Making Moves, and it is a matte, hot coral color. Coral! Get back over here, coral! If you watch Walking Dead, you will know the relation. This would be a great color to wear, like, for Valentine's Day coming up. I'm not going to have a Valentine's on Valentine's Day, but you know what? I'm going to still do my makeup, look good, and go out. This color, mm, mm, mm. I love it. I put a little bit in my inner corner, so good. Um, I heard a couple people say this is kind of like a dupe for Makeup Geek Cocoa Bear. Um, but this color is called Popular Demand. And I feel like this color is definitely going to be a popular demand color because, guys, it's so good so good that red brownish color and this would be so good to smoke out your eye i did use it in the inner corners of my eyelids just kind of building on that dark color but i could put this all over my eyelid and do like a dark smoky look color is top notch and it's a matte terracotta brown color Why you do this to me, Color Pop? Now I'm gonna have to go buy more. No, I got bills I gotta pay. <laughs> this cross will make you jump, jump. That's what this color is. <laughs> Crisscross is a matte brick orange color. My Snapchats, which if you haven't added me on Snapchat, you so should. Definitely check me out. I'm always listening to my 90s music and you know, Crisscross will come on. I'm like, dude. That was a jam back in the day. Ugh, come on, look at that, look at that. Color is called Get Out and it's a matte color and it's a cool cranberry color. Ooh, that's a pretty purple color. This color you cannot get anymore. It was, you know, like um, a special color that they created for their 1 million followers. And this is called Millie, you know, for a million. Beautiful golden bronze color. And of course, keep in mind that like, this is not going to look the same on your lids unless you do it with your finger. If you do it with a brush, with metallics, definitely spray some water or your setting spray. Oh, but look at that. Dude, come on. Alec, and it is a gunmetal color, and this color is called Goody Two Shoes. Oh, but it is pretty. It reminds me of like a pewter um, silver color. A back seat, and it is a metallic aquamarine. 
Um, now, I try to stay away from blue since I have blue eyes. You know, they say, if you have blue eyes, you're not supposed to wear blue eyeshadow. But, hey, I might just break it for this color right here. <laughs> it's so beautiful and so, so pretty. So, my final view on these ColourPop eyeshadows is... They're awesome. <laughs> like I said, ColourPop can really do no wrong in my book. I love them. But these $5 shadows are amazing. They are so buttery and so creamy. They are amazing. Now, um, if you do not have a Z palette, you can get them from Ulta. They range from about $15 all the way up to around like $30. They have different sizes. ColourPop does have some pre-made um, palettes and they are interchangeable. They come with four colors so they just pop right out. They're magnetic so if you want to do do that option you can they are $18 each but if you're going to be getting a lot of colors definitely get a Z palette if you don't already three matte shades nine metallics and one satin and I'm sure they're going to be coming out with other colors too thank you so much for watching my video I hope you like this um, eyeshadow swatch video so thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next one bye guys